Hi all, welcome in the series of AWS Solution Certificate Exam Dumps. So basically in this video we will take one more quick question. We will try to find out uh, the hint mentioned on the question and then we will get rid of the wrong answer. With the same approach we will uh, solve the next question. So this question is saying that a legacy application need to interact with local storage using the ISCI. A team needs uh, to design a reliable storage solution to provide all new storage on AWS. Which storage solution meet the legacy application requirement? So here we will underline the hints. So first it is saying that data is lying on the local storage and uh, we need a reliable we need a reliable storage solution. So this is the second hint here. It means that data will lie into the AWS as well as it should be available in the local storage. While we are using the ISC, ISCSI, which is stand for Internal Small Computer System Interface, uh, which um, inter which means basically interact with the storage. So this is very lightweight, and uh, the reason is that uh, here it is trying to say that uh, all the data will reside into the AWS, but most frequent data is trying to access by the ISCSI and that should be available into the local storage. So we will just uh, jump to the questions now. So when the first one is saying that AWS is snowball storage for the legacy application until the application can be re-architected. So this is wrong answer. Basically here it is trying to say that data must be available in the local storage as well as into the AWS storage. The second question is AWS storage gateway in the cache mod for the legacy application storage to write the data to Amazon S3. So yes, AWS storage gateway provides the data into the AWS by using the direct connector by using the VPC and it provides the two mod. One is the cached mod and another one is the store mod. So this two answer B and C can be right. We will jump to the option D and uh, we will come back to the option B and C. So an Amazon S3 volume mounted on the legacy application server locally using the file gateway series. This is wrong answer. Uh, this cannot be done. Basically here it is trying to say that uh, all data will be resided into the S3 volume while it is hint is saying that data needs to be available on the local storage. So the first uh, we will jump to the option B where it is saying that uh, using the cast mod. So in the cache mod basically it provides the lower latency and in that uh, cache mod most frequent access data will reside into the local storage and whenever the data is not available into the local storage the AWS storage gateway can provide the direct connectivity which will bring the data into the local storage and uh, it will uh, help uh, to ISCSI to not managing the lot of data and it will increase the performance. The third one is the store mod, but store mod it's like uh, backup plan for backup plan. In that backup plan, we generally use the AWS storage and uh, we keep all the data into the local storage. But uh, here, the question itself is trying to say like that uh, they are looking for reliable storage solutions and uh, provisioning all the all new storage where it is not trying to say like that only it is being used for the uh, Mm, backup plan. So I will go with the answer uh, B and uh, I will mark wrong as uh, C. So this one should be correct answer. Uh, I have also included that design of uh, a storage gateway. So here you can see that here you can see that uh, there is a direct connector connect and internet and Amazon VPC is providing the connectivity between the AWS and the customer premise. As per the question, data needs to be available into the customer premise and uh, the storage gateway is helping to upload or download the data from uh, AWS storage. So that's all folks. So I think uh, we will meet into the next question, uh, which, which will be the part of this series. And if you are liking the this video, please like it and uh, subscribe me. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot.